Welcome all. Let's see how to create a function block in ABB. So let's go to add an object from the POU and I'm going to change it to the function block. I'm going to create an average function block. So I have named just AVG. AVG means average function block. I'm going to create. The language will be in the ladder logic. And hit OK. Then here we got the ladder instruction programming average block programming window and I have to put two function blocks with enable right here one is here another one will be parallel and first one will be addition block add and hit enter and we'll be getting the addition block the second one will be the division div and and this is the addition block and the division block how to get the two numbers average and have to use the inputs are n1 right here and and n1 will be a variable input and that will be an integer also okay this will be n2 also a variable input that will be again integer and this will be the addition result so ar i am using that will be the addition result and that will be not variable output that will be variable in out because I am using the output of the addition block as an input of the division block that's why I am using the variable in out so next I am going to change it to the integer so make it as integer also and here I am using the AR right here AR and have to divide it with 2 so this is the AR divided by 2 you'll be getting the average so average average I'm using as the variable output so this is our exact output we are going to use so average Boolean input um, that will be also integer and okay so let's save it save it as a random project any name I'm going to give and go to our new program go to our main program right here PLC program I'm going to put the function block with enable on the main program and name it as AVG AVG I'm going to use and plus enter and you can see the average function block has been appeared over here and I'm name it as AVG Right here now which the AVG has been defined as the type as AVG and okay and n1 I am going to use as a a will be our first integer number I am going to use that will be integer and okay b also an integer okay c will be storing the addition result so that will be also an integer so this will be the average I am going to A, B, C and D. D will be the result we are getting as an average. And that's it. We can go for the runtime. Go to online and login. And now all right. And go to run. We are on the run mode. And have to give some values to the A, B. And we will be getting the average. I am using 7 and 3. Double tap on A and press 7. Okay and for b it is b3 7 and 3 that will be 10 total of c will be 10 addition result will be 10 and the average will be 10 by 2 that will be 5 so i am going to hit control and f7 for loading these values control plus f7 or you can go to online and write values hit the right values you can see that result is 10 and we will be getting Five. this is the average function block customized average function block that we have created and thanks for watching